I've been interested in medicine since I was just a child. I wanted to be a, a doctor. And I developed a special interest in podiatry as I looked through all the many, many surgical uh, specialties. I realized that podiatry is really a more family-friendly uh, focus in medicine. I do have uh, five children. I wanted time for them. And so podiatry gives me the opportunity to not only have a, a very busy and challenging career, but still reserve some time for my family. I actually do have a, quite a conservative approach. I am very conservative when it comes to surgery. You try every other option first. In my opinion, surgery should be the last option. Sometimes that is the option that we need to go to, but we should try every other option possible, from, from uh, bracing, injections, physical therapy, uh, different modalities. Surgery really should be the last option. We do make sure that we try every other conservative option available, and when necessary, go on to surgery. But when we need surgery, we make sure we get the very best results. I am absolutely accessible to my patients. Patients uh, can ask me any question um, during care, after care. I mean, before surgery and after surgery, they can call and ask any question to me. I tell them to bring in all their questions. Any question they have, they can bring a list. We'll answer, we'll go through one by one and answer every single one of them. I want them to be comfortable, that they know what their treatments are for, that they know what's going on. Educated patients are the best patients. It's patients who know uh, what is going on, what needs to be done to treat them. Well, they're basically patients who know why they're receiving the treatment are much more likely to continue with the treatment and have a full recovery. First of all, when I have a patient in front of me, they are my only patient at that time. I have one patient at a time. That's all I have. The patient comes in, they sit down, I listen to them. They, they tell me what their complaint is. We talk through that. We really delve into what is causing their problem. I've uh, seen patients that have seen uh, several, several other local physicians and then come to me and with a little time and extra care, we can figure out really what the root of the problem is and, and solve it. So it is nice that in New Mexico Bone and Joint we have a surgery center right next door. It is very beneficial for the patients who are already coming here to see us. We see them, we evaluate them here, they can have the surgery center right next door. The physicians are very accessible and uh, the travel of course for them is very nice. So they come up to the same location, they can have surgery here. The surgery center is staffed by a phenomenal staff. They are very efficient, very friendly. Uh, we can get people, uh, get people back to, uh, back to full health and on their way at nearly the same location. You know, it was a, it's a hard decision to decide what you want to do in life, and I try to decide, try to find something I would be interested in doing for 40 years. And I think being a, a doctor and a surgeon is a wonderful job. It's, uh, it's fascinating. It's, uh, it's challenging, and it can keep you, keep you interested and challenged for the rest of your life. I wanted something that would keep me um, that would keep me challenged as well as provide an opportunity to do something which is which is good. Provide some service, make people happy, and I don't know much better way to make people happy than bring them in in pain or with something broken, fix it, and send them out happy and pain free. That is absolutely the most rewarding part is seeing people seeing people happy, uh, changing people's lives is really what makes uh, what makes this the best part of the job. Uh, hands down.